name's Greg Walters, I'm from Chamberlain Property Company. We're here today at Upper Brook Street. Um, this is our project which we've just completed. It's a Georgian townhouse, it's a Grade 2 listed building. We've brought back a building that was constructed in the mid 1800s back to life, which essentially has been very unloved for the last 60 odd years. And we've shown it some, some love and put a lot of thought and effort into how the house flows, the interior fixtures and fittings. But uh, learnt a few things along the way on this particular one as well. It's just a passion of mine that I've got. I, I really enjoy taking something that's old and bringing it into present times, but really keeping the uh, character of where it originally was from and sympathetically restoring it so that it can be passed on to generation after generation. That's, that's, it's, that's important to me. When I first looked at this building, um, I came to the property with a view to turning it into apartments, the three flats. But the way the building is laid out, it didn't lend itself for, for apartments. So I had a look uh, in around the area and looked a little bit into the history of the house. It was clear that it was a, just a single family home, so that's what I decided to turn it back into. Because originally when we got here, it was an office and it had been an office um, for the last 60 odd years. We've took it back to how it originally was, kept all of the original features as much as we can and brought it back to life. We were very conscious of keeping all the original fittings as much as we possibly could. So um, there are many original fireplaces in here. We've retained all the original windows where we can and had them renovated and refurbished. Uh, but then we've installed new windows, like for like how they would have been when they were originally fitted back in the mid 1800s. The difference being is that they're double glazed. All of the doors in the, in the property are all original. Um, we've shuffled a few of them around, but they're all the original doors. They've all been fitted with new door fixtures and fittings. Everything's been traditionally fitted. So we've got wall hung uh, systems for the toilets, freestanding bath, three column radiators, that kind of thing to really give it the feel of when it was originally built in Georgian times. Favourite part of this um, house is probably the, uh, the front room as you, as you walk in and, and the, the, the first set of stairs, the hallway there. Uh, what we've done there is we've created uh, Georgian panelling all, all in the hallway as you walk in and at the first flight of stairs and in the front room. That room and the, the dining or breakfast room were split into two but we know that it wouldn't have been like that in the first instance when the house was first built. So we've put that wall back in, we've had some custom made cupboards for the electricity meter and the gas meter and what have you and it really makes that. And we've opened the fireplace out as well, brought in a reclaimed fireplace to fit which was a big job in itself and that's my favourite favourite part of this property. There were a few challenges. Uh, when you start to peel back the layers of a property that's this old, you can often find issues that you need to correct which weren't originally in your, in your budget or your schedule of works. Things like finding beams that needed to be replaced, small parts of wood rot, for example, that we've had to replace. Other challenge would be liaison with the council to ensure that they're happy with uh, what we were doing with the windows and also with the brickwork that we've done. Things like getting the mortar mix right, it took uh, a little bit longer than we would have hoped to nail that. Um, but other than that, it's been relatively uh, plain, plain sailing, really. The project here at Oswald Street is definitely going to provide us with a healthy return on what we've invested here. And investors, outside investors that have invested with Chamberlain, will see a healthy return on the money. <laughs>